It is one of the biggest and oldest parade productions in North America. Toronto's 113th annual Santa Claus parade brought half a million people to the streets, and as always, it did not disappoint. <laughs> For the 2,000 costumed marchers participating in this year's parade, they are unable to suppress their pure joy for the event. It's the same for the tens of thousands who lined the chilly streets on this day meant for believing in magic and spreading good cheer. We love it. It's so much fun. The weather's a little chilly today, but it's still worth coming out to see everybody. Merry Christmas, everyone. I just love it because it's the biggest one in town, so I, I appreciate it that they do it. And I've been coming since I was a kid. The Toronto Santa Claus Parade has come a long way since 1905 when Eaton's department store brought Santa to Union Station for the first time. Today, the parade consists of 28 floats, 21 marching bands, clowns, horses, and it takes more than two and a half hours to wind its way from Christie Pitts to St. Lawrence Market. And the kids have made sure they made it onto the nice list this year. I walked a dog. I... Wash the dishes, set the table with oh, my brother. Wash the dishes. Oh, I, oh, we got sibling rivalry here. There were some new floats this year, including one by Ripley's Aquarium, along with all the old favorites. But of course, the biggest and most impressive of them was reserved for, you guessed it, Saint Nick himself. Merry Christmas, everyone! Oh, 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 oh. The jolly old elf even gave a personal shout out to our station. Oh, that looks like city, I think. We have something hanging down there. Well, well, well. Well, well, it's so nice that you guys here. It is the event to kick off the Christmas season. For thousands, it's a tradition not to be missed. For others, a tradition in the making. This is her first parade, and she's loving it. And of course, the one downside to the parade is major traffic disruptions, thanks to plenty of road closures. Getting around the city is never easy on parade day. All streets have now reopened.